Hey guys, how's it going? Hope everybody's enjoying the 2021. Uh, so I was driving the 53 pickup the other day and I noticed that it was discharging. So I thought this would be a great uh, little video on uh, checking the charging system out. So we're gonna go over and I'm gonna eliminate the generator out of it first, do a couple tests and then we'll move on to the voltage regulator part of it and uh, yeah so we'll get started here in just a sec okay guys so I've got the camera set up now so I can take a reading of the charging system after we start the car and I'll even uh, take you inside and show you that uh, we're discharging and I think I'll do that first I'll just bring you on inside with me as I start it and we'll see the discharging so I think you guys can see this gauge pretty good right here hopefully uh, it's getting a little dark out here so I'm gonna have to hey uh, Austin would you hand me the flashlight real quick please uh, my grandson's getting the flashlight for us so oh here you go thank you thanks buddy Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a little better light here. So now we sh will be able to see the uh, the gauge there. Okay, let's fire her up. Uh oh. Okay. Okay, guys, take two on the. Uh, starting of the vehicle. One thing about live TV, uh, let's go. There we go. See, now I've been charging the battery and dealing with this charging system, so I didn't have uh, the cable over there tightened all the way, but you can see my discharge right there. I'm going to give it some gas. Okay, so I'm I'm under the discharge there. So let's go pop out here for a sec. I'm gonna put you guys on the tripod. And I am going to go ahead and hook the I'm gonna go to the voltage regulator side of this. And you can see there, it's just showing what the battery is charged to right now. And eventually that will drop because it's, it's using the battery. Okay guys, so what I've done now is I've jumped across the field here and grounded it. So I've got a ground cable on the field side of the generator and I grounded it just to the uh, bracket there so what I've done now is uh, just uh, grounded the field so I should charge now because this is going to uh, take the voltage regulator out of out of play so if it charges now that means our generator is good so I'm going to go ahead and start it up and I'll come in here again and if the generator is charging we should be right up to about uh, 14 volts. Okay, you see how the, see how it all of a sudden it started charging right away there? See, it's pegging it, so, okay. That means our generator's putting out. And we should be getting that same voltage. If I come up here and go to the battery side of the, of the voltage regulator, so we're charging right now at 16. So we know that we know that our generator is good. So we're going to go ahead and shut it off here. And uh, I'm going to do another uh, quick test for you guys here, too. 
if you wanted to uh, go to a swap meet or somebody's house or anything like that and they've got a generator and they say it's good there's a there's an easy way to test that and you can tell if the field windings are good as well so we're going to get set up and that's the next uh, test we're going to do here so I'll bring you back back in just a little bit here so anyways um, got the v-belt disconnected from the generator and so this next test it'll be a test that anybody can do with a 12 volt battery and a jumper pack or cables so the far terminal there is the generator one and this one that you're seeing now that's the field so what I'm going to do at first is I'm just going to touch I've got a set of jumper cables that are hot right now and it's already grounded out on the block the generator is so I'm going to touch the uh, the generator one and it's going to run this as an electric motor and it's going to run pretty fast and if the field windings are good while it's going fast I should be able to jump on over to the field with the power wire and it should slow it down because actually it's going to want to try to spin it the other way that way we know that our motor works good there's no broken wires in it and that the field windings are good so here we go See that? Okay, that means the generator is good. So with everything that we've seen so far, with it charging after grounding out the field with the voltage re regulator all hooked up, and then the tests we just did, we're safe to say that uh, I'm going to throw a new voltage regulator in it. And, uh, you know, I'm hoping that at that point then we should be charging. So get set up to take that regulator off and swap it out. Okay guys, so I've wired in the uh, new regulator here. Luckily enough, I was able to get a good, like a Delco Remy, uh, good good American made regulator. So what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna polarize this. So we're gonna jump, uh, uh, gotta use at least a 16 gauge wire or bigger. I've got some number six, some real big stuff here. So what we're gonna do is just jump from the battery side to the alternator side and never go over to the field just these two so if we see a little momentary spark that's okay okay that was it just a little one second little spark so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, fire it up you guys are along with me for the first time here so hopefully we're we're gonna be charging after this this will be its first first startup Okay, she's in the charging. Oh, that looks real nice right there. Let's go take a, uh, a measurement of the voltage with a voltage gauge here. Just going to come up with this uh, ground here and just stick it in the back of the voltage regulator like that and uh, I think you guys can see that okay I'm gonna go into the battery side here and there we go there's our 14 so we're charging now so that looks like it was successful there what happens I'm just out of kicks and grins I'm gonna go down to the alternator side of the generator and see what happens here yep so right off the uh, generator now we're charging at about 14 and a half so that's good hey guys well that was uh, a lot of that was like you know, I tried to start the thing, the battery cable wasn't on. You know, that's just, I don't know, sometimes I just think this real world stuff is makes good videos. I don't know, so I'm just going to leave it in there. And, you know, the bottom line at the end of the day was, is that the voltage regulator putting it in the truck, now it's charging good. And uh, 
one step closer. Uh, what I think I'm going to do now after, since I had the generator off the truck and, you know, looking it over and stuff, I noticed how dirty it was. So in an uh, upcoming video, I'm going to definitely take the generator off and go through it and clean it. And, you know, I'll be videoing that as I do that. So, uh, yeah, that'll be... Uh, make for a nice little video I think and uh, yeah I, I just hope that everybody out there is doing good I'm hoping that 221 is uh, you know a little different year than 2020 I'm sure everybody is uh, happy to see 220 gone and uh, so yeah please subscribe I really appreciate you guys uh, and comment the comments are great and as always stay safe